Welcome back! Today's project is a really quick and easy one. You saw a couple weeks ago did the dresses for the Operation Christmas Child box and today we're working on making some hankies to go in the boxes. Um, we ended up doing three boxes, two for little girls and one for an older boy, so we need hankies for three of them. And we've got some fabric scraps to make a pretty one each and then if you watch the four and a half cent pajama video, you know that my boyfriend got me a couple of bed sheets for 50 cents for three of them. And the one had kind of been chopped up and patched, but it's a good white bed sheet and with a good wash, it's actually good for making hankies. So that one is getting turned into hankies and I'm actually filming these out for slightly. We did the kite and the sewing and now I'm filming the beginning but I can tell you that um, Nivius was very helpful <laughs> and got a new cat toy out of it so she's a happy girl but that's what the, this week's project is I'm going to go and get those sewed well okay I already sewed them but now you get to watch me sew them so I'm gonna go sew now squares of white fabric this is part of the 50 cent stash of sheets. One went and made a trousseau's worth of night things. This one's going to make handkerchiefs for Operation Christmas Child. If I can get it to line up. And I did a video a couple episodes ago on making dresses. Um, and I will link that in the description. But this is a cotton sheet. It doesn't have any polyester in it by the feel mm -hmm. of it, and it's just worn nice and soft. It'll make wonderful handkerchiefs. Nivius! And I'm making them 15 inches square before mm -hmm. hemming. It's a nice big size. Thank you, Nevius. That was most helpful. The good news is the cat hair won't show this time. Yeah. Maybe that's the secret. That's, a, that's a big novelty. Get your key to... Ow! That's hers. Thank you. She claims it. Gibbs. So there's four cut out. I think I want two more. You're gonna have to start negotiations. Nope. I'm just gonna take her for a ride. <laughs> <laughs> she is not convinced. She's not leaving. <laughs> ah, Nivius. <laughs> she is baffled. <laughs> the end she's on is the one with the giant patch so that end will probably have to be trashed <laughs> okay are you done maybe give her the scraps over here and we can there, there you go Go, go play. Come here. Come here, sweetie. Mom doesn't love you. No, nope, don't love her at all. But, oh, you goosed her. Did I? <laughs> you whacked her with it. No. <laughs> Poor kitty. Poor kitty. Poor abused kitty. 
kitty. Poor kitty. Kitty unloved. I took her for a ride. I don't know what more <laughs> she could possibly want. <sighs> So I got the handkerchief all cut out and give it a nice pressing. And if I iron in a hem, I won't need pins while this is being sewed. So I am just going to do a quarter inch hem, fold the corners over. Fold it once, fold it twice. So each side will lose a half inch to the hem. I don't really need steam, which saves me burning my fingers a bit. So I took the pieces that I trimmed off the edge and I laid one on top of the other so it's double thick because she's very hard on her toys. And I just sewed it into a tube, turned it inside out, stuffed it with scraps from Kyle's 14 cent pajamas. They were 16.67 cents, thank you. Oh, sorry. Well, let's just round up to 20 because you needed some trim. <laughs> and the tail is the bottom hem that I cut off. So it's already folded and stitched. And impervious to kitty. Impervious to kitty. So kitty has two mousies from <gasps> scraps. Kitty got new toys and it's not even Christmas. So we found a new way to use the 20 cent pajama scraps. We made kitty mousies. Are you biting it? It's biting it. You're biting its head. Oh, poor Mousy. She has other toys and we have to keep sewing them up because she keeps inviscerating them. But these are double thick, so maybe they'll last a few weeks before she guts them. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. Which, which one do I get? Are you a spoiled girl? So I'm just doing a simple machine stitch on this. I'm going to stitches to lock it in. pivot the corner, I'm going to leave my needle down, raise my foot up, and just swing it around. And by leaving the needle in, it can't stray too far. Mm -hmm. 